This problem states a toy rocket is shot vertically upwards from the ground with an initial velocity of 96 feet per second. The height h in feet of the rocket above the ground t seconds after launch is given by h of t equals negative 16 t squared plus 96 t. In part A, I need to find when does the rocket reach its maximum height, and in part B, what is the maximum height of the rocket. Many students find application or word problems hard as they have to come up with an equation themselves that describes the situation in the problem. But in this case, we're lucky. We're given an equation that describes the height of the rocket t seconds after launch. Well, what type of function is this? Notice the highest exponent on a t is a 2, so it's a quadratic function. And if I graph it, I will get a parabola. And as the coefficient of the t squared term is negative, it's going to be a parabola that opens down, something like this. And what are we trying to find? We're trying to find information about the maximum height of the rocket. Well, where does that occur on this graph? This is where we get the maximum height of the rocket. And what is the name of this point on a parabola? This is called the vertex. So all I really need to do in this problem is find the vertex of this parabola. Well, how do we find the vertex of a parabola given in this format? This is when we need the formula that the independent variable t equals negative b divided by 2a. So in this case, remember a is the coefficient of the squared term. So in this case, a is going to be negative 16. b is the coefficient of the linear term t, so b equals 96. Plugging those into this equation, I get t equals negative b is 96 divided by 2 times a, which is negative 16. So I get negative 96 divided by 2 times negative 16 is negative 32. Negative 96 divided by negative 32 is 3. So when does the rocket reach its maximum height? At 3, and what are the units? Seconds. So at 3 seconds, the rocket reaches its maximum height. So that is the answer to part A of this problem. Now we need to find the maximum height of the rocket. So all we have to do is plug 3 into our function. So to find h of 3, I get negative 16 times t squared. So that's 3 squared plus 96 times t, which is 3. So I get negative 16 times 3 squared is 9, plus 96 times 3 is 288. Negative 16 times 9 is negative 144 plus 288. And what is that? That is positive 144. So the height of the rocket at 3 seconds, when it reaches its maximum height, is 144, and h is measured in feet. So the maximum height of the rocket is 144 feet, and that is the answer to part b of this problem.